Hi, student. Um, in this part, I will do the review of uh, microelectronic manufacturing course, this elective course for senior student of uh, electronic engineering, KMTL. I'm going intend intend to do uh, in English, so uh, you can. Uh, listen and practice and I will do that in Thai soon but this one is going to be English well uh, the final exam is will, uh, will come sooner in a couple of weeks and uh, I do exam or uh, the final exam is the it's going to be a open book so you don't need to worry what you need to do you need to understand materials that I present class seem like two months start like two months ago the first part is going to be your definitions or some terminology you need to explain what does the six sigma means um, and then there are also some uh, short term for example, what does this mean FIT? What does this mean uh, um, Six Sigma? And the second part is going to be your basic calculations that includes the, um, what I present in the class. Um, we have what? We have um, reliability. We have our yield, process yield, die yield, and also our some our cycle times, right? This means our, the time you need to process your products from start to finish. And then uh, we're talking about our system reliability. When you have our devices or components connected in the term of our series arrangement and our parallel arrangement. You also have our the acceleration testing in the term of our temperature, in the term of voltage. But what I present in class was the, well, the temperature. As I mentioned about the Arrhenius equation, you have response R equal to R0 exponential uh, to a negative EA over KT. This EA is what? EA is the activation energy rate. K is the Boltzmann constant. And T is uh, the temperature. So you can uh, just go back and uh, study from there. i also talking about our transmission line, right? Or uh, in our class we're talking about a micro strip line or uh, you need to uh, calculate for the characteristic impedance of the transmission line you need to do a reflection diagram or a lattice diagram you need to understand about the reflection coefficient from the load line that's pretty much about our transmission line and I also include their electronic packaging system because some of you are we were go to work you know uh, for a company that's related to electronic packaging system so I introduced the heat transfer I introduced uh, thermal resistance sorry thermal resistance circuit you need to be able to calculate for uh, RT or thermal resistance and also you have equation delta T equal to QRT when uh, delta T is the temperature different Q is the heat flowing into your system in the unit of what and also RT is the thermal resistance from that point you be able to calculate for uh, 
what the junction temperature, right? For example, I did in class to calculate junction temperature um, of your ship carrier. You have the ship sitting on your silicon or wafer, and then you have die attach attach your ship to your lead frame. So from that point you should be able to calculate for the junction temperatures. Students should have no problem if you attend class, you know, literary. But you have to work hard if you were miss, you know, many classes. And uh, for uh, the third part is going to be uh, about six sigma. So I give you a uh, data and then you will analyze that data to see if your process passed Six Sigma program or not. You need to calculate for CP, CPK, right? Capability index. And then uh, you also uh, start from what? From data given. You calculate for the mean and you calculate for uh, Sigma. And then uh, you set lower scale limit or LSL and you set up upper scale limit or USL. You set up your target, for example, in the term of uh, resistivity or uh, the tension voltage of your transistor. And that should not be a big problem because I already you know, show how to solve the problem in class. I repeat that again and again. So that's pretty much about our, the final exam. And uh, for documents, don't worry about it. I don't want you to uh, make uh, too many uh, copies of documents. So I will prepare documents for you that are necessary for you to do the final exam. What you need to do is just uh, bring you a calculator and uh, it's going to be uh, it's pretty much you know close to what I uh, show you in class so you should not worry about it too much and uh, if I have something I will add it you know to my cook's radio again and uh, the following uh, Cook's Radio is going to be a uh, review of the final exam microelectronic manufacturing. Thus, I will do that in time. Okay? So, uh, hopefully, it's going to be clear for everybody about the final exam that's coming soon in a couple of weeks. If you have any question? you can uh, message me to uh, my Facebook. And today I will see you in the class at 1 o'clock. It's not going to be uh, uh, nothing much than uh, the class review and uh, ready for answer your questions. Alright, I'll see you uh, in next cook radio. Okay, bye.